Hi, Mark here, I trust you're well. In today's Lightroom quick tip, we're going to look at backing up your catalog. But before I do that, I'd like to tell you about my live Lightroom and Lightroom Classic events, where most weeks I host up to two live events on Zoom. Our Lightroom community, which is up to two hours, where we look at a theme and tasks and answer your Lightroom and Lightroom Classic problems and a Lightroom short, 30 minutes drilling down into a single task. I hope you can join me. Just visit lightroom.support, sign up for my newsletter and you'll get those details. Now, without any further ado, let's jump across to Lightroom Classic. So here I am, I'm in Lightroom Classic. First thing you need to consider is where do you back up your images? Because backing up your catalog only restores the information that's within Classic and not the images. So either using some form of copying software or perhaps you have a attached device that automatically backs up your data. Perhaps you use a cloud service. So for example, Backblaze or maybe Amazon Photo, if you're a prime customer. So that's the first thing to consider. The actual files, where are they being backed up to? And the second thing you need to consider, in my opinion, is your frequency of backing up your catalog. Now, what is the catalog? Catalog is the file that stores all your history, or your metadata, all your edits, everything about the workflow within Classic. So how do we do that? So we come up to Lightroom Classic, we click on Catalog Settings, and under the General tab, we have this frequency. Okay, so it's once a month, once a week, once a day, every time I leave Lightroom, and the next time I, I exit Lightroom. Now, for most hobbyist enthusiasts, it's going to be once a week. That's what I would suggest. However, I use Lightroom every single day. So what I have is every time I leave Lightroom Classic, it offers me the opportunity to back up. Doesn't mean I do back up, I get the opportunity to. Because I go into Classic in the morning, First thing in the morning, that is, I go in at lunchtime, I then go in in the evening, perhaps. And I'd like that opportunity for me to say, oh, I've spent three hours at, you know, doing a lot of culling and metadata that I want to choose when I want to back up. So for me, in my work catalog, I have every time I exit. But I would, as I said, suggest most hobbyists will be once a week. Now, for this purpose, I'm going to select the next time I exit Classic. So I've selected that from the drop down, press X. Now I'm going to exit Classic. So Lightroom Classic and quit. And then a pop up appears. Again, at the top in the drop down, that is my frequency, my default frequency. So in this catalog, which is my training catalog, it's once a week. The next drop down where it says choose that is the location where you're going to store this backup that's really important because you do not want to store it on the same drive that you've got your working catalog so if you think about it let's say you have a laptop you spilled coffee over your laptop your backup and your working catalog is in the same place perhaps that drive goes faulty your backup and your working catalog is in the same place. Now I do understand that you may have a cloud service that your folder may be on that drive and that's fine because it can go to the cloud and you have your backup in the cloud. So if you click the choose, that takes you to the location where you're going to back up. Now underneath, these two boxes are really important. Test integrity and optimize your catalog. So Classic 
is going to look at your catalog, make sure everything's all nice, organized, sorted, and there's no problems. And then it's going to sort it all out for you. It's gonna put everything in the right order, make sure everything's in the right place, and it's optimized. Now, if it's the first time you're backing up your catalog and you've got a, a large catalog, that may take a little time. And to give you an idea, I've got something like 400,000 images in my working catalog. Bearing in mind, I've been a commercial photographer for over 30 years. And it takes about 15 minutes to run my integrity and my optimization and to save it to an SSD. So just gives you an idea of how long it may take you. So now all you do is you click back up and this has only got five, 600 images in there. That's how quick it is. So that's how you back up your Lightroom Classic catalog. I hope it's of help. And if it has, please like, subscribe and join me. Lightroom.support for my weekly live events. Bye for now.